Today we're going to create some origami. Remember, origami is the art of paper folding. Today's origami is going to be just a little bit more challenging than what we've done in the past. We're going to be creating the origami jumping frog. Let's get started. All right, guys. Today we are going to be creating the origami jumping frog. So I have a regular piece of paper and it is in front of me like a door vertically. I'm going to take my left side and I'm going to go ahead and put, uh, bring it over to the right side of the paper. The edges are matched up. The corners are matched up. I start in the middle and I push my way out to make my crease. I'm going to go ahead and open that up. I'm going to take this left hand quarter and I'm going to bring it down. Not all the way, but I'm going to bring it so that the edges line up. And I'm going to crease, open. I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to start over here. Making sure that everything is lined up first before I crease. Okay, I'm gonna open. So now I'm going to flip my paper over. I'm gonna use the center guide and I'm going to fold the top down, not all the way, but just right there at that center. Make a new fold. I'm going to open and I'm going to flip my paper back over. The reason why we wanted to do that was because when you take these two middle, um, middle folds here on the sides, you push in and down. You push that one in and down and you kind of have the top part of your frog or the head of your frog. So now there are two flaps here. I'm going to take the top flap and I'm going to fold it up to the center line. Same over here. So now I'm going to take this left hand side and I'm going to bring it into the center and crease left and I'm sorry, right side and crease. All right, so now I'm going to take the bottom edge and I'm going to fold it about halfway where you see this diamond, it's gonna go right that center point in the diamond and I'm going to crease it and I'm going to take this bottom edge here and I'm going to fold it back down. These are the jumping frog's legs. So then I'm going to flip it over and I'm going to add some eyes to my jumping frog. Draw some ovals. have to pull his legs out a little bit. Got his arms over here. But then you push on the back of him and he jumps. 